Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Agent Psycho. Right now, I'm uh, doing a quick video in order to see the difference between the Ace AK-12 and the, orig the, the regular AK-12. For those of you guys who do not know, um, Nexon has recently implemented a change where um, you can actually buy two different kinds of NX standard weapons. The Grade 2 and the Grade 3. The Grade 2 is basically a nerfed version of the original uh, NX standard weapons. Um, right now, I'm going to use the uh, the Grade 2 AK-12 to see exactly how, how well it does over the, uh, the old AK-12. Or, yeah, the old AK-12, the one that was originally NX standard before the patch was uh, released. So this is this is just like a, a field test uh, video to see exactly how much worse the uh... okay well that was awkward and we're back in another game before I got kicked out of there uh, mid mid sentence so in any case um, where I was leaving off just to reiterate um, Nexon has basically uh, created two versions of all NX standard weapons in the game the grade twos and the grade threes. If you owned an NX standard uh, gun before this patch came out on July 23rd, 2014, then that means your NX gun, whatever NX gun you had for perm, is technically a grade three, which is the best or the better version of the whatever NX gun that you uh, that is available now. Ah, you dying. But so um, yeah. Uh, I'm. This video is just to try to see if I can see any difference between uh the original or not original the uh grade two AK-12 and the grade three AK-12, which is called the Ace AK-12. All grade threes have the Ace tag in front of them, so be to uh, signify that they are the better, quote unquote, better variants. So um, yeah, that's basically the point of this video, and uh, the. Apparently, according to the new stats that Nexon has given all the guns on the AK, especially on the AK-12, the AK-12 Ace has two po uh, more points. Ooh, sorry, teammate, has two more points of, um, or two less points of recoil, and um, I think a slightly more range, 60 more range to be uh, to be precise. So um, technically, I mean statistically speaking, you would think that hey, the Ace AK-12 is obviously better than the uh, Grade 2 AK-12, right? Well. I'm going to. Uh, I'm actually making this video in order to see if you can actually notice the difference. For example, I'm using the uh, Grade 2 AK-12 right now. See if there's, if I can feel, you know, a, an actual recoil increase from the uh, from the old AK-12. So that's basically all this video is going to be uh, be about. In fact, when we spawn in next time, we'll, we can actually go ahead and test the uh, the AK-12 here because we got a lot of walls. So this is going to be the AK-12 full uh, full auto. The grade two one. Okay, that's kind of what the recoil looks like. Hopefully, you guys have, have uh, memorized that. And the original AK-12. So I think the I think there is a noticeable difference. In my opinion, I could be wrong about this, but it seems like the AK-12 uh, Ace, the grade three one, the original and an extended variant, does kind of have does indeed have a slow uh, have a lower recoil in the fact that. It seems like the recoil vertical uh, vertical rise or the vertical of, or recoil is slower than the one on the AK-12, which does come into effect more often than you might think because it is vertical recoil. After all, what the hell did I just get shot by? Okay, that was weird. But um, yeah, I guess there is a difference that you can see. But um, let's see how well it does in an actual combat scenario. Because so far, it doesn't really seem all that much different, to be completely honest. Yeah, I mean, like, like yeah, sure, it's got a little bit more recoil, but the AK-12 always had a lot of recoil to begin with. For example, it's it's dam it's not like its damage got nerfed at all, so you can still kill people really, really quickly. But, um... Yeah, all, all the AK-12, um... The, uh, the non-ace AK-12, the grade 2 AK-12 has, is just... A little bit more recoil and slightly less range. That's about it. And as, as long as you guys can uh, kind of get over that, then there's no reason why you shouldn't just buy the AK-12 Grade 2 over the uh, AK-12 Grade 3, unless that really bothers you that much. Obviously, I'm not really doing too well for myself right now, but hopefully, you can pick it up. There we go. That guy always lottos me for some reason, but then again, I shouldn't be talking because I just lottoed the hell out of someone. Round start. Oh shit. Ok, 
Okay, clearly right now um, I'm not doing very well for myself. Let's now switch to the Ace AK-12 now. And uh, for some reason, again, I got kicked. So, hopefully that video got cut off there because I accidentally uh, pressed my recording, uh, my uh, shut off recording button by, uh, by instinct. But hopefully you guys have seen um, basically what it can do. Uh, obviously, all the guns in the game, as I've mentioned before in my other video, uh... Are different. All the guns from grade two to grade three are slightly different in what how they're improved. You know, from mark grade two to grade three. But um, it's just it's really up to you guys to figure out. You know, which guns are more or less the same. Which guns do see do appear to have a noticeable change from grade two to grade three. So again, it's up to you guys to find to find these things out. I'm just here to let you guys know that there are definitely changes as far as the stats go in uh, in terms of whether or not you know the grade twos and the great threes are really all that different so anyways thank you guys so much for watching i uh, hope you guys have found this video useful and uh yeah i'll see you guys later